Well, I left Myrtle Beach this morning, got a late start, kind of, but it was still early, and uh, I came to the mountains, <laughs> and I'm in, uh, right here close to, in the Highlands, called Highlands, North Carolina, they're going to have a car show tomorrow is what I heard when I went through, they were talking about it, or start setting up for tomorrow for the weekend, and uh, anyhow, I came, I went to one that's called Blue Something, I can't remember it right this minute, and you go past, well, I'm on a, I'm down miles of dirt road. And my bike's not made for this. But, uh, but I'm secluded. Uh, right back there. I've camped here before, not here, but up there where the, the pit toilet is and all. But these are along the way, there's places. But anyway, the other place I went to. I didn't have no water or anything yet, and I had looked it up on the internet and all, and was reading things about it, and they were saying you can't, you couldn't leave your campsite. If you left your campsite, somebody was going to steal something. Well, I got mixed up, and I went there, and and it's not really the people that camp down there that's stealing it, probably. You go through a bad, backwoodsy place. I mean, there's a house, you know. There's some nicer yards, but most of them have just everything you could think of from the last six refrigerators they owned and the washing machines and everything's just thrown right there in the yard all around. And uh, just pot, I mean, I... Uh, yeah, I thought about the movie Wrong Turn, and it was after I passed the last house, it's like three miles further up in there. Well, all they have to do is take CBs or something. When they see you go out, one could be down there pretending he's camping or whatever, and they could rob the heck out of you. But, I mean, it can ha that can happen anywhere. But I've gotten here, and this got a picnic table, and there is some rocks for okay. a fire. Anyhow... So I came on up in here, turned the bike around before I even shut it down. And uh, there's this wood. I don't think it's going to burn too great. But whoever left, they did like I do. A lot of times I'll prepare things way ahead of time. And then I have more than I can use. But they left some wood right here that's chopped. And, you know, and there's some, I guess they were trying to use that to get a fire started at one time. But here's a bag of charcoal. It feels like it's probably about a fourth full, maybe a hair more. I've came by this one before coming in, but this is coming in the back way and it's a lot longer. So I'm going to go ahead and set up camp get the tent up and everything because shoot i don't even know what time it is i think it's going on six about six o'clock or a little after but all right that's a day's journey but i've but i've been a lot of places on the way here you know just riding around kind of looking and scouting uh, well i got camp set up i don't know let's see here I'll show you what it looks like. All right, see? I'm working on getting everything ready for tonight, but I've already got the tent set up. I played around a little while before I, I just slapped the tarp over it. Because when you're in the Smoky Mountain area and all, you're going to get water at night. Rain or either a heavy dew. So I just went ahead and did the tarp. And it's just something fast just stuck in the ground. There was a nail already in the tree, so I used that. And then I got it anchored over in the back on that side. But I played around and split a little bit of this wood that was here made some kindling and it's green so i i doubt i even use it and i might put it on the fire after i get it started with some 
dry wood and stuff but and when i get a fire started i might put the charcoal on it i'm i'll probably i could leave it there for the next person but uh yeah i just working towards getting things ready i've already got my uh stuff thrown in here my sleeping bag and a one of them foam pads under there but uh all right um i'm probably going to eat real light tonight my plans are to move to another spot tomorrow that's why i'm not going to set up big i'm just going to uh stay here tonight and i'm going to get out of here um I mean, it's okay. It's got a picnic table and a place for a fire. But if I have to go to the grocery store or anything, it is so far on this road. And, and the part when you first come in was really bad. I mean, and my bike's already hit bottom a couple times. I'm, I don't have nothing to guard my uh, engine block. So I don't need that to be happening. But the road was so bad coming in to, at the start of it. And then all of a sudden, it's, a sign's there. And it says, end of state man maintenance. As soon as it got past that, the road's still terrible. But it's, it's, it's a lot better than what the state's maintaining. I guess the county maintains this other part. Oh, um, this is... Um, government property government woods maybe uh maybe that's who's taking care of it after that sign okay i'm gonna get off of here and uh fix a little something to eat just a snack i don't i'm don't think i'm gonna do nothing big tonight i rode all day now tomorrow <clears throat> the phone don't pick up in here so you can't use GPS. So what I got planned is when I get to the highway and get where it'll work, I'm going to look up a couple of places and find a place that so that I'm more happy with. It doesn't. It doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be a wonderful place. It just somewhere where I can get to a store and get back and not worry about camp well right there's where you go down to where my motorcycle and the tent set and around this away i'm just standing there quietly i hadn't even come and looked at it yet but i can hear the water so uh i come i'm coming to find it and i see there is a bridge here i was wondering how oh so there's a stream not a big one but I love that sound it, it helps me sleep let's see what it looks like after it goes under the road and comes out this side oh Sean that looks pretty good there just ain't no easy way down God, I could get right there and get in there and take a bath. It might be cold. Hmm. Well, that's... You'd think people would have a path down to it. That's camping right there. And maybe they used to. <laughs> um, earlier, I saw a black snake. Or one of the shiny ones look long and thin. I call them black runners. I don't know if they really are, but black snake that's long and has no legs, and I call him a black runner. Well, the stream looks like it's a little hard to get to.
these back over here and see what swat. I'm going to eat something light tonight, but I'm I don't know what I'm going to eat. I've got I got those instant mashed potatoes and a can of spam, but I didn't buy eggs. And I've got potted meat and a, uh, six packs of potted meat and some Lance crackers. And I got the Goober peanut butter jelly mix. And I got wraps. And I bought uh, one can of hot and spicy. Vienna's I think I said that right well I haven't built a fire yet hey you're not going to believe this I was uh looking over the edge some from my camp up here a little further up from my tent and my in the um picnic table and everything and I found this path and because I can I can hear the stream I don't know if y'all can hear it on the phone you know but uh so I walk down this path and right now it's about five minutes till 8 p.m. and uh, Wednesday night So I, I knew somebody, if they camp in here, they had to make a trail to get to this stream. I mean, <clears throat> and enough, you know, just about anybody, look just like me, I could hear it. I wanted to see come to it, you know. But now this is, um, this is before it gets, you can't see the bridge that we were on. But anyway, the water's running here. And, uh, and it actually looks like, like right here where that big rock is, then right in here, it's, it don't look, it don't look that deep on the camera, but, I mean, it looks to me like it's about a foot, foot and a half deep right there. Go out there and put a towel on the rock or something and it'll rinse off just to feel a little better somebody got some rocks out I guess of the stream and set them up here I'm still leaving in the morning though Ooh. That was going downhill to a little low place back up. And I'm headed back to the to the camp over there. Hit it up. Alright, I just thought I'd show that while I'm here. Later. Well, I'm loaded up and I'm about ready to pull out. 
So uh, let's hit the road. Ugh.